What is going on guys, welcome back to the channel for the super quick video and today we'll be talking about if posterizer badge is working on current gen. We all know it doesn't activate so there could be two possible reasons. It's either there's a glitch that it's not working at all or there's a bit of a glitch that yes badge is working, it just happened that there's a programming error making it a ghost badge just like your slitter finisher back in the past two case. This one here is really quick so make sure to watch it fully so it'll make full sense. And after watching, please let me know in the comments section any recommendation for a topic. I'll see if I can sneak that in on my last push on NBA 2K22. So now let's get right into it. So for the test, we'll be doing this sequence here in lots of repetitions. And I'll take note if it's a dunk or not, then we'll cross compare no badge and hall of fame. And to make this test more accurate, of course, I'll make the samples the same as much as possible. So here are the results. In here, it is obvious that yes, even the badge is not activating, it is working. 2K just made a glitch, making it a ghost badge. And by the way, don't focus much on the actual numbers, we just want to see if there will be a reasonable difference, so we can declare if it really works. And in here, you can see it was unanimous on 5 trials. Just for additional info, on my first batch of tests, I tried to test both of them at 99 driving dunk, and yes, there was still a difference, but it was not that big. That's why I tried to drop both of them to 88, testing if maybe the boost will be bigger, then after seeing the results, it is noticeable here that the gap got bigger. Meaning, posterizer badge impact will get less the higher your dunk rating is. I'm not saying that if you have like 95 to 99 driving dunk, it doesn't deserve a hall of fame, no. We all know if you're really making a living with driving dunks or standing dunks, of course it deserves a hall of fame. I'm just telling you this so just in case you wanna save some badge points so you can invest on other aspects of your finishing game and you already have high driving dunk rating, I think one way is to downgrade your hall of fame to gold because you already have high dunk rating anyway. Just some additional info for you to factor in. So that's all for the video. If you guys like it, please smash that like button and please consider subscribing for more videos. And don't forget to drop by the channel for lots of other contents. And as always, stay safe and happy gaming, guys. Peace.